Hail and well met everyone, Captain Deadeye is back with you with more World of Warcraft Dragonflight and our Magar Orc Warrior. Hope everyone's doing well today, thank you so much for clicking on the video, thank you for deciding to spend just a few moments of your day with me. We're going to queue up for a dungeon here as you can see, or waiting on a healer of course, as always. And uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and finish up this character, hopefully today, I don't know if we'll hit 69 or not, but uh, we're 68 right now, on our way to 70. And then once we finish this character up, I'll let you guys decide on the next character uh, through a poll on our channel. And it looks like the Zandalari Troll Paladin is making a comeback. So we'll, uh, we'll probably play him next, uh, unless the uh, poll changes between now and the time that I uh, decide to start a new character, or my next character. So we'll see what happens. Uh, but yeah, Zandalari Troll Paladin, I'm fine with Paladin. Paladin's my favorite, so let's do it. All right, I gotta get warmed up here in tanking. Let's see what we can do this morning. Haven't played this character for a couple weeks, so. AOE incoming. All right, let's get started. Here we go. Like a pretty decent group here and we're gonna pull everything apparently that's fine too tanks doing a good job <laughs> and the healer's doing a good job too we can't we don't want to forget about the healer we can't stay alive without a healer so. now how the hell do we pull these other guys come on man I definitely didn't pull them. Huh, I didn't hear him make his little speech about interrupting Melodrusa's work. Good stuff. Let's go. My allies sacrificed themselves so that I could return these eggs to them. You will not interfere. I think we will. Watch your step. Oops, I should have saved that for the, uh, the little guys. I didn't do it. The whelps. Dude, get away from everybody else when you do that. Don't drop it right in the middle of the room. Wow, that she went down quick. Good work, champion. Now that you have secured the pools below, I require your aid above. Hmm. 
The exposed life pools are in grave danger. A powerful primalist is attempting to burn all the nesting areas. You must clear them to get to her. I will keep watch from above while I confront the dragon who is leading this assault. I do enjoy this uh, Ravager attack. I think a uh, Ravager AoE is pretty sweet. You know, there's those swirling swords around me, or around the uh, area. AoE I'm gonna have to roll a monk, dude. Monks are, they are really powerful in this expansion. And I like monks. Monks, I, I played a monk as my uh, main alt uh, through uh, Warlords, and it was a lot of fun. Warlords and uh, Legion, I think. I played a monk quite a bit. I played every class in Legion because I wanted to get all the uh, class horror hall quests and class mounts. They have all the class mounts except Priest. I just, I'm not a not a priest fan, so never played them that much. And I have all the flying class mounts except priest and demon hunter. And for some reason, I I did everything with demon hunter. I just never got the flying mount. I don't know why. Was that? Oh. Random weird music crescendo there. And these fire guys are going down really fast. Come on, everyone look at me. Let's go. That's enough of that. Oh, well, he's already dead. Jeez, he went down really fast. Don't stand in front of the giant magma boulder. Nice. Some good upgrades this morning too. Vile monster! I protect these life pools. Uh, no. Oh, where'd you guys come from? Yeah, this monk is rocking on some damage, man.
Sometimes it's harder for healers to, to heal through these things with both these channelers pulled at the same time, but I went ahead and pulled it anyways just because it's, they're right there together. So let's just get it done. There it is. Lost my mouse there for a second. I was like, yep, can't see anything. Your false queen cannot stop us. We are the truth. Defensive. I didn't see I didn't know where the dragon was going there. Defensive. This is a good DPS group and we're doing we're doing well. How do you have the aggro? What are you aggroing? Look at me. Come on. Run out. Nice. That was good. That was a good run. Thank you, champion. The light pools are safe for the moment. But and we hit 69. Perfect. Still a threat. We must I don't know if two more dungeons in this run will do it, but we'll see. That only again. took 12 minutes. That was quick. All right, let's see. What we got here? Charge an enemy with your shield, dealing 50 damage, and stuns target for four seconds. If your Ravager kills an enemy, it lasts two seconds longer and deals 20% increased damage. Reduced by 30, but now has two charges and generates 20 rage each time it deals damage. Wow. Let's do... Yeah, let's do this. I'll do 20% increased damage. All right, let's go up again. That was a quick run. 12 minutes. Look at that. Really fast this morning. And we'll do the same thing on my Paladin because I'm going to roll him as a uh, prot so, as well. Oh, Nefarious. Why? Always Nefarious. Death Knight, Priest, Druid, and a Shaman. the XP we can get in here because I want to level.
finish up this guy. Ouch. Guys like suck me toward him. Charging. Move. Charging. Hey, he's almost Move. dead anyways. I don't know why I popped those, but I did. Somehow I changed shoes along the way. Looks like I don't have any shoes on, or boots on. I have to uh, transmog when I get out of here. Actually, I think it was in the last dungeon. Get those bones cleared out! We must be prepared for Chargaff's plans! Come on, everyone, look at me. Let's go. Intruders! Where have you come from? Now Thoris belongs to the Kalashi now. Yeah, one thing they, uh, they just released was the orc and human heritage armor. Now, the human, I know I have maxed out uh, rep on my mage, but my orc, uh, the only orc character I think I have is a, well, I may have one more, but a warlock and a shaman. I don't know if I have max out on either one of those. So I may have to go grind some rep in like Magister's Terrace or Botanica. Uh, those those seem to level really quick. I had to do that on my uh, Worgen Rogue or Worgen Druid. Uh, that was how I got the uh, Worgen Heritage set. On. Everyone look at me. Don't look at him. Don't attack my buddy over there.
Watch where. There we go, take a seat. Stuff's dying quick. Love it. These guys you can't stun with shockwave, so. But they are going down nice and quick. That's what's that's what's good. I don't know why they didn't charge those guys. <laughs> they would axe at them instead of charging them. I will not jump into the middle of this boss with everything else still alive around it because he does too much damage for that crap. I don't know why that the last time we were here that tank did crazy stuff and was pulling half the instants.
Come on, come back over here. Everyone look at me. Let's go. Don't attack him. I even taunted that guy and I didn't pull him off of him. Special coming. Wow, that was quick. Jump right back to the forge. Normally doesn't go that quick. Come on, come back Watch up here, dude. Step. Wow, he went down quick. Got leggings, or got a shield. I don't know when I picked that up. It's a pretty sweet looking shield, too. on any of these guys either and it's unfortunate because shockwave is pretty fun to use but none of these guys are affected by it So guys, one thing I forgot to mention earlier, and well, I haven't mentioned it yet because it just started this week, but I did start the um, Forbidden Reach quest line on my Paladin, and I forgot to take you guys along with me. So I apologize for that. <coughs> so I think what I'll do is once I, I've noticed that it, it really, it all evolves around the Drakthir, um, and it would seem very appropriate to take a Drakthir there. So I think what I'll do is once, uh, since I've already played through the probably three quarters of it or majority of it with my Paladin um, and did not record any of it, and I do apologize, I think what I'll do is I'll take uh, my Drakthir there once I finish uh, hit 70 on the Drakthir on uh, on Alliance, and we'll take him over there so, and do the quest line. And it makes a lot of sense because a lot of that quest line all revolves around the emergence of the Drakthir, why the Drakthir were there, what Nefarious was doing with the Drakthir, or Neltharian, and kind of their purpose all together. Um, so it would make tons of sense to take a Drakthir there. All right, guys, we're at a half an hour. That's already two dungeons down. Let's do another one. That's two great DPS groups, so hopefully... This will be another uh, good DPS group. And we are at 56% to level 70. So. Oh, I knew it was going to be this one. I just had a feeling. I did not want this one. I wanted the... Uh, I wanted Ruby Life Pools again. Good. You are here. I welcome Onara's rage. When the winds are still, I will suspect the worst. Oh. 
All right, folks, let's go. Now, how do you have the aggro? You gotta be kidding me. Speaking of Drak here, we have one in this group. That's awesome. I really enjoy playing the Drak here. I know people didn't like it. Uh, you guys, a lot of people downvoted it uh, on YouTube, and I, I really don't care because I'm enjoying playing it, so I'm going to play it. None of these guys are affected by his stuns. How oh, this guy had the aggro? Come on, now. being stunned for two seconds. No wonder, because this Drak there is macking on damage, man. Jeez. He's in the millions. Love it. You gotta be kidding me. How are you gaining the aggro? I just taunted him. Just pumping out right. damage, which is why. Ready to interrupt. There you go. Good job. Remember that group I had there last time did not know how to interrupt. We wiped here. We did not fire the ballista at all. Nice, we got 6% just by killing those guys there and the boss. Pulling aggro again. Please.
Oh, that was way off. Hit Thunderclap when I landed and was not even in the middle of these guys. Jeez, lightning. How do I not have the aggro? Come on, look at me. Look at this. Like, I, I'm taunting this guy. And nothing's happening. He's still looking at the, the Drakthir. Jeez, or the Evoker. Somebody's got the shark. I saw it. The ghost shark. Trinket. That's a really fun trinket. I enjoyed that one a lot. Just funny to see a ghost shark come out of nowhere and impale this guy. Impale an enemy. And it does massive damage, too. Still on cooldown. I was like, why am I not doing anything? Okay. Went to the wrong one. I meant to go to the one over there, so this one would be the last one, but oh well. I got confused on where we were.
Not that it really matters because we got to take them all out anyways, but it just allows you to kind of run down, run down this hill over here, over to the uh, the boss. They're not saying what they usually say. That's weird. Like their voice lines are, are not uh, activating for some reason today. It did it in the first dungeon, too. I didn't hear him talk about the Melodrusa and... Defensive. I don't know who put the uh, skull on there, but I didn't Defensive do it. Just... Defensive. Run. Here and come. Knocking back. Watch your step. How we pull these ads? Everyone made it. Looks like we're good. Come on. Don't want to attack the Drakthir or the Evoker. Defensive. One cool thing they've added in uh, the uh, Forbidden Shore is, or the Forgotten Shore, whatever it is, I think it's Forgotten Shore. They um, they did add catch up mechanics, so you can add like the the armor drops Thank that you can you. send to your other characters. I love that they did that in uh, Legion, and I had all my characters like. Pretty much twinked out by the time I got to 70 because by the time, you know, they were they hit 70 because they were, uh, I got so much gear on my Paladin and other classes, uh, other alts as I leveled. Gosh, dude, this guy continues to get the aggro. 
So I'm definitely doing that. I've already got a couple pieces for my Evoker. I got a piece for my Rogue. Might send it to my Druid since I'm going to level him next. But I think it's level 70 gear, so I don't plan on playing um, my Rogue much anymore. So. Man, gear is dropping like crazy. Look at that, guys. We are almost to 70. I think I'm just going to go out and do a couple world quests. I don't think I want to run another dungeon uh, just because we're, we're so close here. But I may. I don't know. Let's see. What we get there? We got that. That'll work. I'll take that. And we got that piece. Very nice. All right. Cool. So we are... Jeez. We're 19,000 from leveling. So how much do world quests give? I think it gives 10,000. Yeah, so do two world quests and we're, we're pretty much done. Everywhere I look, I see something that needs cataloging. While I'm busy here, do you think you can document along the river? Oops, didn't get anything in that one. There we go. I don't know where the legendary is for uh, for this one. I don't think I've ever gotten that far. Really that was easy. Here, Alright, one more. Let's see what we have. Uh, I don't want to do that one. Is that a race? I think it is. Yep. Alright, let's go do that. Join us, and we can see how your skills oh, are coming here. along. I knew that. I don't know why I went over there. I never gave up. All right, here we go. See, why wasn't there a uh, boost going up that that steep incline there? Or one of these things? One of those lifts. It just seems weird. And there it is, guys. Level 70. Awesome. All right. Guys, thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this uh, Magar Orc Warrior playthrough. Uh, I know it's been a long time. We've been playing this for, I think it's somewhere around the 13 episode mark. Um, but it's been a lot of fun. I've enjoyed playing a warrior. I've enjoyed tanking, actually. Um, it's difficult because you have to keep the aggro and it's hard to... Hard to keep everything, you know, um, the uh, there's a Forbidden Isles, or Forbidden Reach. Um, it's hard to keep the aggro, especially when you have, like, someone like that last dungeon where the DPS is, is macking, I mean, they're macking on DPS and pulling all the aggro. It's just difficult, but it's all fun. So, thank you guys. I really do appreciate it. I hope everyone has a great day. Take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and we'll see you next time.